Maggie, you set your BG high against Evansville, and you've already reset it. Which, um, are, they, are they calling more plays for you, or are you just, you know, like tonight, making all your shots? Um, I think it's just, you know, you just got to finish when you're in there. I'm playing more of the five, so I'm, like, staying more in my comfort zone, like, down in the low, um, low block this year, so just trying to step up and fill the gap from last year. So. When you haven't missed a shot all game, do you tense up? Do you think about it, or you just... Um, no. You know, I mean, did you know that you were perfect? I, did, I actually didn't, so, I mean... <laughs> Um, Lauren, just talk a little bit about just coming out here and playing as well as you guys did and putting them away pretty early. Um, you know, it was a fun game to play in. I think, you know, looking at the score, it looks like we dominated this game, but looking back on it, we made a lot of mistakes, and there's so many things that we need to improve on that we are kind of actually disappointed with our performance tonight, and um, he was a little, you know, upset with the way we were executing. So we're happy with the win, but we have a lot to improve on to move forward and be a better team. Isn't it difficult in a game like this when you're so far ahead to, to motivate yourself? And doesn't that lead to some mistakes, maybe fundamentally? I think that's something you know, a senior leadership has to bring. That you know, we have to play through these type of games, even when we're winning big. We can't make those little mistakes. We need to execute every time on the floor. And you know, that starts with our senior leadership and going all the way down the line. I mean, I'd agree. We're a veteran team, so. You know, that focus comes and we need to, like, pass that down to the underclassmen. Were there some specific things that, that you guys need to work on? Like when you say there's some made some mistakes, what were some of the things that you saw? I think one of the biggest things that, you know, he pointed out to us at halftime was the amount of plays that we ran wrong tonight. Okay. And those just aren't mistakes that we can have right now in the season that we're still running plays wrong. So that's the biggest thing we need to fix and, you know, just running the plays right so that we can execute better. Is that just a lack of not paying attention or not, you know, some people not being familiar with the plays? I think, you know, it's just a lack of focus. We need to go out there and be focused and be ready every night and be prepared. And just we can't lose that focus in this type of game. And Maggie, obviously Lauren and Tracy score a lot of points. Are you maybe viewing this as maybe a chance for you to step up and kind of pick up the scoring, scoring load a little bit? Um, I mean, yeah, sure. I just want to be whatever the team needs. So, mm -hmm. you know, different nights, like, I can adjust. And if I need to step up more certain nights than others, I'm just, yeah. Okay. And either of you guys, what do you guys take away? You, you mentioned there's some things you need to work on. But what, what can you really take away from a 46-point a win maybe moving forward? I think, you know, we take away some good things with the win, and you know we can look back and see some of the good plays we made. But I think the biggest thing we need to do is look back and see the things that we did wrong, so that we can improve moving forward to become a better team. Which is, you know, our biggest focus right now is to get better every day. Okay. It shouldn't matter like who we're playing. We have to come out every game like it's going to be the biggest game of the season. So then when we get in those games, we're ready for it. The, the roles on this team are becoming more and more defined. As far as you, you talk about, you just kind of want to fill in where, where you're needed, whereas right. Lauren obviously is going to be provide more of the scoring. Right? right. I think it's still definitely early. Like, we've had people come in and have big games off the bench and step up, and that's awesome. And we just have so much depth. So I think that um, we can see, like, a lot of different things every game. But slowly we're kind of finding our niche, I think. Yeah. Maggie, you said that you're playing more of the five this year. Yeah. That, are you more comfortable playing five? Um, I think I think so. Like I've really liked it this year in the offense playing the five. So. What do you like about it? Um, I I like playing more like in the low block and that area and defensively and yeah, that's where I'm comfortable. So. Okay. Any other questions, guys? Okay.